What's up guys, Everything Apple Pro here, and iOS 9.3.1 has been released today. So this is an update we have been expecting due to the huge amount of issues in iOS 9.3. Now I'm sorry I'm getting this video out to you late and outside, I left my lights out at the studio, but I did wanna go ahead and fill you in on all of the information about iOS 9.3.1. What's changed, what's new, How's the performance? Has anything really changed? Uh, and overall, just all of the information you need, including a jailbreak update. For all my people waiting, desperately waiting for a jailbreak, I just wanted to fill you in on some information. So 9.3.1, what does it fix? A lot of people after updating to 9.3 had an issue where in Safari, loading links would automatically cause your device to crash. Hyperlinks in general wouldn't work from any application, messages, Safari, anywhere. You know, your device would just crash. So iOS 9.3.1 focuses on fixing this. And as a result, it's a fairly small update. It was, I think, about 35 megabytes on my 6S. So that's pretty much what it will look like. Now, on my personal iPhone 6S Plus, I was curious to see before and after updating what the storage was at. So before I was at 113 capacity, 71.4 available. After updating, that went to 71.6. So I got 0.2 gigabytes back in capacity course was the same so a little bit of a change there you know that's nothing like a feature or anything probably cache files but 9.3.1 is a very very simple update just a small one and it fixes that one bug and a lot of people did immediately say hey it makes my device feel better i honestly couldn't notice a single difference with speed but i'm going to go ahead and run a geekbench real quick to see if there is anything that's changed whatsoever all right and this is what we're looking at so on the left 9.3.1 seems to be a little bit better actually noticeably so this might be worth something checking out with a speed test i don't know let me know if you guys want to see that but it seems like it does have the higher geek bench of the two overall performance wise wouldn't say i notice anything different i mean the whole fact that things don't crash anymore is probably a good thing and no the landscape lag on my 6s plus has not been resolved those are my birds over there so sorry if you guys hear stuff um there we go that lag is still there intermittently so uh, that's a little bit disappointing. Maybe 9.4, maybe iOS 10 will fix that. So about the jailbreak, ENMTW has given people renewed hope that he might not be a hoax. So he actually said in a tweet that he's gonna go ahead and announce the information about the release date for his jailbreak that will work on 9.3 later tonight. Now earlier, he also did say that this is still compatible with 9.3.1. It's very doubtful. You know, I'm, I'm very skeptical of him. He might have a jailbreak. He might not. But he's our hope that we can see might have a jailbreak. And if anything, hey, we'll learn about it later tonight. But he has no more excuses. The SE is out. iOS 9.3.1 is out. 9.3 is out. I mean, there's no reason he should delay this any further. So hopefully we hear something about that tonight. If not, there's always Pangu and Taiji. And let's not forget that April Fool's is tomorrow. So this might be just an elaborate April Fool's joke. We really won't know. Maybe he planned it around that way. Who knows? But point is, you know, be very skeptical. We'll find out later tonight and tomorrow what's going on. We might have a jailbreak literally hours or days away. Now, what you guys need to know about where you should be right now, he basically said in a response to another tweet is stay where you are right now. We don't know for sure about 9.3.1. He says it's still jailbreakable, but it's always good to be on an older firmware. And besides, you can always update to this firmware, he says, is jailbreakable in the worst case scenario. So guys, there you go. Thanks so much for watching. Just a little update for you about the jailbreak, about iOS 9.3.1. Very, very small update, but hey, it's here. And uh, if you guys don't care about jailbreaking, it's definitely worth upgrading to. It is a more stable release. In general, 9.3 has been great and I'm happy to update to 9.3.1. So thanks so much for watching guys. Have a great day. Peace.